Although the Lake Turkana wind power project is expected to begin injecting power into the national grid next week, there is no precise estimate of the amount of power that it will be producing despite the testing that has been on ongoing. Alex Mwangi toured ground zero of the project in Loyangalani, Marsabit County and reveals why insecurity has been one of the major impediments to the success of the project. These boys herding their livestock in the rocky and undulating hills of Masabit County are soaking in the changes to their landscape. The Lecturkana Wind Power Project, which has a capacity of 310 megawatts, is rearing to go. For the next five days or so, they will be working on the instrumentation. That is um, synchronizing our machines and the ones of Lecturkana before we now energize the line. Security has been a big issue for the project. The ease with which these local boys are walking around the wind farm points to the difficulty in adequately policing the vast area. We've had uh, a contract, a contractor's team being attacked even later, is about, about, is it three weeks? Yeah, two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, I mean, they are being fired on, shot at around just here. Barago is uh, almost 100 kilometers from here almost 100 kilometers from here. I sought to find out the level of output that has been realized so far from initial testing. That is what I'm saying we don't know. Lecture Kana is saying 310. But uh, we've made a provision of uh, under the PPA, is it 52 or what? Or 52 percent on the average. On the average. So if you do that, 310, it should not come below 150 megawatts because otherwise it will affect the, 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 the whole grid countrywide. As far as the Electricana wind power project is concerned, this is ground zero, where 310 megawatts will be evacuated into the national grid. There are 365 turbines all around me, sitting on 40,000 acres of land. The way the line was designed is a uh, is a double circuit 400 uh, kV line, which can evacuate about 1,200 megawatts. So one line comfortably can evacuate 600. The wind project is the largest of its kind in Africa. As the wind powers the region towards prosperity, one hopes that such boys will eventually get to lay down their weapons in favor of getting education. Should that happen, it will be real development for the locals arising from the expansive wind project. Alex Mwangi, NTV. Alex Mwangi was one of those in that story wearing the hard hats.